really, truly, Rome has been um, on my map to come visit, and this race has been on the map for me to participate in. I'm really excited. I'm scared. I'm yeah, not gonna lie. Scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> and there's there's hills here. I'm like so maybe. <laughs> Like, we okay. Have, we have seven plus heels. And, uh, <laughs> so and I will be on one of them or multiple occasions of those hills this uh, in the next couple of days. Well, we're very excited. Mm. So we invite everyone to come out. We have over 30 athletes who are racing here. Karen is one of 31. We have five stages and we start tonight. And that is at six o'clock out on the Western Bypass. We are doing the Need for Speed race, which is where they filmed the movie Need for Speed here in Rome. So tomorrow morning, Friday, we are out at Rocky Mountain Recreation Area. We're doing a 36 mile road race around Rocky Mountain. Saturday morning is our infamous Fouché Gap Hill Climb, where you will be climbing up Lavender Mountain, which is our tallest point in the How County. ironic, Lavender Mountain, all soothing. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> and Saturday night is our Fast and Furious Downtown Criterium, where basically you're going around a two-block course for 35 minutes. Stop Fast. making me scared! <laughs> Stop making me scared! Fast <laughs> and strategic, oh. and all the people will be able to see you up close, and that's tons of fun. Our final stage is a time trial on Technology Parkway, where you're racing against the clock. A lot of our youth that are in a wheelchair don't realize that there are different opportunities right. for them. And we're opening a whole new world for them. With, with our partnership with um, Infinity, and we also have donated um, a hand cycle to the Floyd County Board of Education. Awesome. And we'll have um, more recipients this year. But, um, you know, their, their job is the rehab of these youth. And, um, and just by introducing sports and I can't spill the beans, but there are a lot of exciting things on the horizon for the youth of Floyd County. Whether you're sitting or standing, just say yes to things. I mean, that has been my entire life, and, and that's how hand cycling came into my life, which is the irony, like, oh, I just want to hand cycle, and, and you know, you, 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 hey, I'm going to go to Alaska to do this race, and, and then I meet someone I mean, from Georgia, <laughs> and, you know, we don't, we don't necessarily know what the serendipities are of our lives. You know, when you can say yes from the top and say, hey, you know, go through the door, you know, it, it, it becomes, you know, less of a wall and more of a curtain where you're like, hey, look what's on the other side. And the people involved in this race have been so kind. Like, they've been so kind um, and generous with um, their information to me personally, you know, because I've only been racing a little bit over a year. I can't even call myself like a racer. I just, I ride my bike. Whenever we have events, we're always looking for volunteers, and I guarantee you, the minute you volunteer and witness all of these events, you're hooked. And mm -hmm. I think just the more we can spread the word, the more volunteers we can get, the, the greater it's going to be for our A great place to start would be um, such as our partnership with Race Rome, which is Racing Awareness Charity Events of Rome. And we have partnered with several different events in Floyd County. And, um, sponsorship dollars because those dollars go towards purchasing these chairs, um, the, tennis, the sport chairs, the hand cycles for our youth, and we are really focused on the youth. I'm just a little bit biased, you know, about wheelchair tennis and, and hand cycling and all sports for people with disabilities, but, you know, when you see that moment in somebody's life, um, again, whether they have a disability or not, or whatever is going on in their world, when you see the moment in their lives where their world gets a little bit bigger because of something that they learned or something that they're giving or something that they, that they want to do that's of service to somebody else, I mean, it really does. It's a, it's a beautiful gift to humanity and it's a beautiful gift to service. It's a beautiful gift to Rome, Georgia, and it's a beautiful gift to yourself. And we're really excited about everything we have planned for the weekend. And I would like to invite you all out to, to um, our races, to spectate, it's free. And um, information can be found on our Clock Tower Classic Facebook page. We have a very vibrant uh, racing community, whether it be 5K, 10K, cycling, 30K, it, it, it's all happening in Georgia's race.